Yeah, you can just feel the buzz in this city all day long, and we are seconds away now for this. Carpat's got it along the wall. Here he is in front. Can't connect. Ulu's got scores. What a shot. He drops into the butterfly to try and take away as much of the net as he can. But the shooter's got enough time to find some room. He sees it, and he doesn't miss. Ulu's taking the lead here in the late goings of this first period. Pretty even first period. Now they've got the jump. Kupio's on the attack. Inside. Scores! We're all tied up! Oh, it's getting to a stage in the game where you think they're not going to be able to find the equalizer. But they stay at it, and they get it done. He's played a terrific game, James. Now, this late goal will end his shutout bid, and he won't be very happy about that. Kalpa's late third period goal certainly opens up a lot of decision-making for the coaches, doesn't it? It does, but they must feel... Time for the shootout, and so many people will complain about it, but when it's time to actually let this thing... Un It, right, right? Yeah, keep it as uncomplicated as possible, and he makes a good save. Here's a great opportunity to take a stranglehold on this shootout if he can deliver a goal here. And he buries it for the goal! I really like how he made this look like he was good at deep, but he doesn't. He stays with the shot, and he capitalizes. Sometimes you choose to shoot and there's just nothing there. I guess we can call this shootout overtime. This game is still up. Scores! Oh, what a snipe! Didn't have much room. It looked like the goalie was in pretty good shape. But this one's in the back of the net. On behalf of Ray Ferraro, I'm James Sabalski. Thanks for joining us. Good night.